top play of the week nominees were heavy with hockey highlights with three great goals and one score that would be denied. The other play coming from the hardwood. We see where the voters place this week's nominees. And the lone basketball play of the week comes from Vermont's Ernie Duncan at number five to the streaking Kurt Stidell as he's fouled as he gets up the layup for the bucket. It's all hockey from here, and if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Joe Draven playing a little duck, duck, goose. Third time's the charm for the goal. High school hockey, PHS looking to get on the scoreboard, but no goal here as Beekman Town's Taylor Lauren comes up big, making the stop, deflecting it up and out of her net. Melissa Sheeran has made her way to the top plays a couple times, but this one may have gotten the most attention and most votes, making a couple great moves before scoring right between the defender's legs and in for the red light special. Then there was one. Ten days into the new year, this play happened and was already looking to be one of the top plays of the year. Norwich's Tyler Piacentini takes us to a jaw-dropping ride, spinning us around the defender, scoring backhand up top for the goal and for the play of the week.